Hi everyone, I'm Clip. We're back for some more Darkest Dungeon 2. So I've already built the team. Uh, we're going with Hellion, Jester, Grave Robber, and the Plague Doctor. The Hellion's a bit meh, because it's got Pacifist. If we can remove it, it's great, because it's got Breacher, which I think is one of the best on any melee character. Trying out the Jester. Doesn't seem they have much going for them until we upgrade a few things. So I don't know why that's upgraded. Regardless, will they all have that like that? Is that correct? No, yours is upgraded because you have Apprentice. But regardless, uh, we're not taking the Harriman. I don't want negative banter. Team stress is very hard to deal with. There's no clear way to de-stress because everything's gated by different ratios. Anyway, this is what we're going with. We'll crack on. Forward now into the crumbling chaos of the world. Right, our starting items. Anything decent? Speed. That seems really good. Increasing the stacking. Not too much. Uh, who do we want really going first? Either of these two because of the dots. So we'll probably up the Plague Doctor. That's the only trick it right. And, well, you can have the resist. I do still think they should cut this. This is kind of pointless and repetitive. I wonder if it's only for the act. Uh, weirdly enough, so I beat the brain. I don't know if they just haven't done the act. So I thought they did up to Act 3 so far, but I can certainly pick Denial. Everyone's the same. Still kind of torn. It definitely doesn't have the feel of the first Dark Dungeon. It's not horrible. Probably stick with it for a little bit. Uh, I think I definitely want to unlock everything before I it to bed, at least till the other updates come out, then at least I have everything prepared for when the full game's released, because I feel like that grind is not as rewarding as the grind in Dark Dungeon 1, but something I'd rather just have out of the way and then try and enjoy all the content. Right, so our Grave, Ray, grave Robber has Dead Eye. Much better for range skills. What are we doing? 3 to 5 versus 5 to 8 versus 3 to 6 plus the dot. Probably try and stack dots on A slow you. Dissection. An unavoidable uh, I think playing grenade is better than Noctis Blast. No, 4. Ah, uh, but that's for the front, that's why. Anyway, what are we up to? 5 and 9 to 6. Bit unfortunate. You can slice off. Make some dots worthless. But oh well. Bleed out. Four, that's enough. At least the Hellion won't take anything at all. One. Plague Doctor can't really deal too much damage. Uh, slice off. Skill-wise, I've just tried to make sure they can all hit everything. An unexpected find. Push on that was a big issue with the last run. Best we couldn't really hit. I think it was the third slot. Just, just heal my stress. Again. I have a few things. Stun resist, move resist, and just health. 
probably save them on this first area. And uh, we want to taught. upgrade. That you may stand just a little tall. Lay down, it's not a huge damage increase. Iron Swan. Always my favorite for dealing with the back line. 30% crit is also really good. Any of yours worth it? Not really. Good from set chance to guarantee crit. Does it push? It says target forward one. So does that make them move forward one or us move forward one? Because in the original, we went forward, I'm pretty sure. Or was that for solo? Now, this doesn't reduce the target stress bracket. So we're probably just grabbing Iron Swan. Usually the enemy you want to prioritize is always in the back. Probably don't want to buy anything. We do have this. Decide where we want to go. Probably for the... Yeah, just grab hope. So we can continue to level up. I can't remember, I think I looked... I think the cap is like 50. This just seems awful trying to get to. We'll leave it at that. Don't even know how I get back to this screen. Who needs health? You need health and you need health. Hate for you to move. No stun is always good on damage dealers. I should do. We might as well give whatever items we have. Vitamization also seems a bit budly to me. Like, being able to use them from your inventory. I understand it's overpowered in the sense that you can collect so many, but I think it'd be more utilizable. Being gated by four slots just makes it un worthwhile, so to speak. So we're looking for Hero Shrines. Uh, so we probably want the Watchtower. Also, I don't like this, the fact that it's very slow. So we didn't uncover any. It's unfortunate. So we'll just go wherever they want to go. Again, I'm going to cut out all of the travel. I think it's pointless. Field Hospital. Great. Hopefully we can get rid of pacifists. We can. Even That's pretty much it. I don't think we have enough gold on this to get rid of anyone. No, it's 16. Quick and easy. Got lucky on a hero shrine. Probably stick with the Hellion. Or the Grave Robber. No, probably just try to unlock everyone. So far the Hellion's my favorite class. Chapter three, Night in the Woods. As the advancing army moved on, she huddled tightly in the tree's clammy roots, hoping to be somehow swallowed up into the earth. At dawn, she woke tormented by the exuberant cries of carrion crows, come to feast upon the corpses of her kin. When at last she stirred, the scavengers took flight, repulsed by the sight of this undeserving revenant. What do we get? It's a self heal. Moves horror. Hmm. It's good. Not great. I'm pretty sure we do have a slot for it, though. Yeah. Sort of just a normal whack, or is it? Oh, we don't even have wicked hat. Toe to toe, then maybe. Because we have the middle two, back, front, and then a way to clear the winded. Uh, don't care. Well, I should also be going for that. Not that we've seen any. Uh, yeah, so we can. Let's skip the watchtower. Oh, there's lots up here. One, two, three. So we can still get done even by going to the watchtower, but in saying that, if we go to the watchtower, then there's no point. So we might as well go for this one. 
Combat time. Unless anyone wants to run. Nope. Don't know what that is. Uh, we'll probably just go with our attack up. Kind of seems like a speed down, maybe. Right, you're on 18. We can deal... Not quite enough. Pretty close. Can't hit the back. So, with you... We want to kill some of the livestock. Can we do it with flashing daggers? Four to six. Have to get lucky. On to the next. Uh, play grenade is back too. Can you resist? It's unfortunate. You're gonna eat. Why did you go forward? It was something I used. Yeah, uh, you're taking six. It's fine. We want to kill you. Move back. Cool. Thank you. So we probably want to deal with this guy. Forward one, back one. It's the only way we don't move. Uh. No, so we can't bleed out unless we're in one. So you don't play nice with the Jester. Probably want to swap him and the Grave Robber. We have to go back. And then forward. No. Four, three, perfect. So you're gonna... Chop. Doesn't heal you, does it? No. It's fine. Dotting might have been the better option there. Six, nine. Uh, oh, we can only if it bleeds from there. So we need to get rid of that as well. Should have probably done the heal. Doesn't really matter. You're dead to the dot. So we do want to swap skills on the Hellion. Once more. Let me... We don't want bleed out, we want wicked hack. So don't hit the third slot with the Hellion though. Right, so we're probably skipping the Watchtower. Just getting the academic studies done. Road battle. And it's fine. Try and take care of the front one. Should be enough with the bleed out, pretty sure. And I replaced the wrong one. Of course I did. Saving Grace. Forward. Two down. A petty hindrance. Way to bring you forward would be nice. Ah, uh, we could eat a corpse. I'll do.
I believe we've got enough now to finish you off. An inkling of potency still lingers. Great, the Hellion. Well worn relics. So, where was it? Uh, if it bleeds, for bleed out, and the trinket that we just got. Be really good. Twenty percent damage. Awesome. Onwards. First academic study. What can we do? Yeah, I don't want to fight the Shamba. Today's oversight is tomorrow's regret. We just have to visit. Yeah, awesome. Doesn't really matter which one we go to. Destiny will not be denied. Probably go to the assistance counter, so we're going far left. Second study, Shambler again. Nope. A simple yeah. choice. At least it should be. Probably sleeping. Not gonna risk it. That team's fairly good. What do you have to offer us? We're just taking the torch. Well, actually, that's decent. Six gold for a bunch of stuff. See what they get us. Food. What you can. Eh. And be all Not the greatest in items. Yep, yeah, still just leaving. Quirks seem all negative, to be honest. There's a few that are stand out, like obviously Breacher. Except if you had Breacher on any other character besides. Man at Arms, I guess Jess is alright. Iron Man be awful. And then there's a lot of negative quirks that are just horrendous as well. Big boy. That guy needs to die though. I don't want stress. Of course he resists. One off. Eight black. We've got two rounds of avoiding heavy damage. So you're dead to the dot next turn, so we don't have to worry about you. We can. Out. These barks are also kind of annoying. I wish they were like the first game. They didn't flash like that. They're just text box. Uh, slice off. Stack the bleed. Diving for a crit. Build relationships or something off it. That was sort of a yeah, sort of a mistake. But I forgot that he had death store. Still, really strong team. He chatters incoherently. Any you can't buy any trinkets. The food, probably save it for later on. I trust you have calculated your odds carefully. This will not be easy. Make the differ. I think we'll do just fine. Ah, uh, three, damn it. Dead to the dot. Probably want to dot you. 
Of course. Three, six. Uh, so we can kill the bleed. They're both going for us, so we'd rather kill him. Of course he resists. Survives by one. So we take four. A deliberate and methodical Do we have a way to hit him? Of harm. <laughs> but no, no, we don't have a way to hit him. Thank you. In crisis, no gain. Definitely want me bleed. What's what's your slice off? It's just three. That is what I'm thinking. That trinket is, isn't it? No, it's just damage. Uh, nah, we'll just stack everything on the alien. Deals the most by far. Sun resist for you. What items should probably while we're at it, because the lay is coming up. Yeah. I don't think we've done the boss for here. The or did we? Was it was like a corpse or something? Do you hear the child I can't remember. Cries? I don't want to force him to heal. Be resistant. Played this pretty badly, to be honest. Too incisive. Seven fourteen. Heal? No. Interesting. I'm gonna kill you then. Six, six, no six. Uh, get lucky. Nope. Stress heals nice. Headbutt's not. Or just as heal. If 33, so nothing at the moment. Have to move back. Can't move forward. You. Uh, so yes, we want to kill the boss. I think we're well equipped to. Definitely just going to prioritize the goat at this point. Pretty sure they all have some very bad stuff to do with it. Blind is better though. So they all have high resist, fortunately. Please sweat. That's fine. Blinds, not so much. Nothing clears blind. Uh, which one's that one's back? Stressed. No, just a pull. Toe to toe would be great right around now. Let us hope to finish this. Ah, uh, of course. Yes, we try to poison. No. Uh, who are we buffing? Who has to go on the Hellion? Forward. Pull again.
bad for multiple reasons. Mainly because we can't hit you now either. Thankfully, we're not being punished. What's your resist? And you just cycle through corpses. But you are in position. Hopefully, we can dogpile you. Why can't. Oh, it has a cooldown. Not healing anyone. We can buff you. Hopefully, we can do enough. That's the door. It's black. Thank you. The unrelenting application of violence yields morbid gains. Should probably stress heal. Five, you are. Should be able to kill you before you attack, so try and recover a bit. Both do the same. Might get lucky. He did. And it has death storms, doesn't it? Well, it's unfortunate. Sweat soaked brows, unsteady stances. Exhaustion takes hold. Stack for us now. Terrible, terrible, terrible. I have to stress heal. Heal, or do I just try? Another impediment cleared with impunity. What's the boss? Born to a corpulent, half eaten. Then I've done this. The child is a ravenous avatar of degeneracy. Guessing they poison or something? They have a lot of health, too. Try and dot them. Dissection and unavoidable. Tempting aroma. Yeah, so it looks like debuffs. Got lucky on the blight. Definitely want you blinded. Whatever you do. Let's try and set. Uh. Hunger overwhelms all reason. Deals a lot of damage. No, that self is minus, isn't it? Yeah, this is not looking great. This is somewhat better, though. We do a lot better damage back here. I'm 
really glad it's showing me the numbers. Don't do the Hellion, thank you. So you're just gonna move forward till you can eat. Generosity, but a welcome one nonetheless. Should be fine. Stress is the only real issue. Health, not so much, because you heal on the road and you heal at the end. Uh, but you know, you move forward, which is actually very good. Death door, not so much. You're gonna eat though, because you're in one, but hopefully we can kill this guy. One down. Uh, bleed out, kill the other one. And we just need to heal. You didn't get um, minus damage. Curiously. This wound at least has been tended to. You got that time. Are you blight resistant? You are. Taking three. This wound at least has been. You don't have any status effects. Alright, now we just have to deal with the baby. The greatest. Test of all. You can heal yourself, so we heal the Jester. From the brink. And no that's a what? Guess we just persevere. <laughs> There's not really much we can do though. We can't dot you. You're gonna push our position, the plague doctor's gonna be useless. And then the grave robber's gonna be useless. This is unfortunate. The greatest test of all. Well done. A setback. Nothing more. Except for the fact that the grave robber can't attack anymore. A setback. Nothing more. So what, we just drink absinthe till we're dead. Never mind. Death comes for the rich and poor alike. Remain undeterred, and you will yet prevail. Alright, so don't try the layers right from the get-go. Probably unlock a few more skills and get your trinkets. Oh well. Shorter one, for once. Hope you enjoyed. See ya.